What is going on everyone? Welcome to the channel and welcome to beautiful Medina Palms. So thank you to Medina Palms for inviting us out here for a beautiful weekend. And I know you're not seeing it at that time, but it's actually Valentine's weekend, eh? Yeah, that's true. We kind of we dropped the ball on that. <laughs> and thank you so much to Skyward Express for flying us here. It was a great experience as usual. Yeah. Are you guys ready to see this place? This is pretty nice. Beautiful beach, beautiful chairs and everything behind us, but it gets much better than that. <laughs> so for once, let's actually start at the beach instead of at the room. You'll see that later. You got lots of time. Beautiful little private beach in the sense of like you have your own beach up here and then it can go down into the public beach. So that's actually a really nice feature to have. Amazing like lawn chair ambience. Like love that. And um I'm slightly really hungry right now, so behind us there's a bar and I also see gelato. Maybe. Hey, hey David. <laughs> Want gelato? Maybe one cup. <laughs> Welcome to the beach bar area. It's super cute. And we're just waiting because I think we're gonna get some ice cream. Got gelato. Mango. It's the best flavor. Pistachio is, yeah. but they didn't have it. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Highly suggested. Strace is gonna keep eating that while giving you a tour. And we picked up a new subscriber, the bartender. <laughs> So there's actually three pools here. Kind of one lower, middle, and bottom. And this one's the adult pool, and then they're all connected by like a beautiful strip of almost like fountain water in the middle. Not a fountain, but you can chill there as well. So yeah, lots of options for a pool. Okay, so while you're here, there's actually different types of accommodations you can get, and there's even apartment style as you'll see. So I think you can get like a one bedroom, two bedroom, three bedroom, four bedroom. And I think some of them, if they're penthouse, even have a plunge pool on top. At least that's what I see online. Maybe tomorrow we'll be able to check that out, but um, let's go see what we're saying. Beautiful little spot to have your meals. So there's even like a small convenience store almost, and we'll explain to you why when you see what's in it. And welcome to our room. They locked it extra. here are things like we were just gonna have like a one bedroom suite which is totally fine by us but actually we have a two bedroom so come see this is a master bedroom we've got the bathroom in here it's already done for turn down a little bit so the net's already around but you have a king size bed here beautiful AC life um, and then you have patio doors there and I'll show you why over on the other side come on back out and then if you go across the hall it's basically the exact same thing over there they call it a twin but it looks the same, <laughs> just no balcony. Okay, and then you come into here, and this is what I really didn't know that this had. There is a full kitchen here, like stove, everything here. Microwave, fridge, that's cool. Um, and then over here, you have your dining room and really, really nice coloring too. Um, I will say it doesn't matter because it's in the bedrooms. There's AC in the bedrooms, but no AC in any of the main areas but there's lots of fans. So then you come down here, beautiful full light mirror, love that. And this is your living room area. So another TV, you've got some lounging space, and this actually is our balcony. Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time I think we found one of the best spots in this resort. We're literally really like spot. sitting in like a, a, a mini dowel. It looks like a dowel. Yeah. Drinking some rosé. Pretty good. Overlooking the beach. Yeah. Doesn't get much better than that. Cheers. Cheers. Time to go for supper. To hang around. 
So first supper tonight, they have a grilled barbecue kind of supper with seafood. It looks delicious. There's a lot, a lot of variety. And then we have a guy playing jazz just for us. So that's very nice too. So I like seafood, but I'm not like, don't go on my way for seafood. It's not just something I don't do. For the first time in my life, I'm actually going back for seconds on the seafood buffet. It is very, very good. Very good supper. Now it's time to go to bed and enjoy this beautiful AC unit. I love those so much. That's pretty great. And then tomorrow I'm so excited because I don't have to put an alarm, which is I great. Know. But that doesn't mean we're not going to do anything. Trace is very tired. <laughs> so we're going to see you tomorrow for another eventful day. Good morning, guys. We slept very well because the bed was extremely comfy. But one thing, there's a light that has been shining directly into our room in the middle of the like, night. I woke up at 12.30 yeah. and I literally, I was like, man, I, like, I didn't even move. I was like, That's, it's only 12.30. I'm going to fix that right now. This is the light right there. There you go. <laughs> Ding! Much better. <laughs> Time for breakfast. Breakfast, check, it was very good. It was actually a decent buffet breakfast. Like, I would say on the higher end of buffet yeah. breakfasts. I really liked it, yeah. my omelette was delicious. Now, we are waiting for a ride, and not any ride, the best kind of ride you can get on the coast, because we're going somewhere where I'm very excited to go there, because I like these kind of things. Dude. He's literally like a little kid vibrating inside right yeah. now. You, get, you guys remember if you saw the uh, Dubai series when I was petting a penguin, I'm almost as excited. <laughs> Didn't experience the coast if you never rode a tuk tuk. So today we are here to see the turtles. So we are actually in Watamu at the Loken, Loken, Local Ocean Conservancy. <laughs> um, and actually, it's the only one here in Kenya we learned, and it started in 1997. So it's really cool. Um, we called beforehand, and we hear there's actually a turtle here. Yeah. So. I mean, it's not good that it's here because they need help, but like... Yeah, that's but they're cool. actually, there's <laughs> one in rehabilitation, yeah. so normally uh, the turtle come in because it's hurt or something like yeah. that. They fix it and release it, so Let's see. I'm excited. Yeah. Amani, this turtle arrived here at the rescue center five days ago after some fishermen caught her in the in their net. But she actually is here because she got injured by a predator. So hopefully, eventually, she's gonna be sent back to the ocean, back with her family. Just after a few days, this turtle is actually doing much better apparently and it's probably going to be released this Monday, so that's great. What if it's scary? Me! Oh. <laughs> Aww. I'm the biggest <laughs> So that was super cool, super interesting. It took about 45 minutes and it's totally free. They work on donations. So if you come here, like highly suggest anything help. Um, we'll put their Mpesa uh, down below if you want to donate, even if you didn't come to save the turtles. Mm -hmm. Don't use straws, don't use plastic bottles. Be the mindful. Yeah, be mindful when you're around reefs. They do, they do cool. a lot to protect the turtles. Uh, basically all the turtles here uh, are, are threatened. Yeah, so, yeah, endangered. Yeah, so that was very cool. I'm glad we came, and I I want you to come. You need you need to see what's going on here. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. <laughs> so we just got back from the turtles, and it's a little hot. It's very very humid this time around. 
So we're gonna cool off, go for a little swim, and probably get some ice cream. <laughs> Tracy and her ice cream. I have to say, this pool here, or those pools, depending on how you wanna say it, because technically they're all connected, it's as good as it gets. Like, I really, really like it. It looks cool, and it's gonna feel amazing. So I think for the afternoon, we're just gonna chill. There's not much planned, to be honest. We did the turtles, and I really hope that's not drops of rain. Yeah. There's a lot of big clouds over us. And maybe later we need to arrange and maybe go see some of the other rooms that they're available. Yeah, we're gonna show you some more because there's really some cool rooms here. Yeah. And then, I'm, I'm so excited for tomorrow. Tomorrow's Me gonna be great. Too. And we got some cool people tomorrow. Yeah. Great friends, Yeah. great activity. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. <laughs> and um, this chick might be hurting after tomorrow. Let's just say that. It's possible. <laughs> Very good plus paper straw saving the turtles. So now we're gonna try something that I personally never tried before. Tracy did it once on the lake. Are you good at it? No. So that's gonna be funny. So we're gonna do a transition from the good camera to the GoPro in three, two, one. And us again in a GoPro version. <laughs> to the beach. Tracy's signing our lives away as usual. So I guess we're gonna do a little bit of kayaking instead. Kayaking? Uh, kayaking. <laughs> because at first I thought they had paddle boards, yeah. but, but they, they didn't. It was bunny boards and stuff like that. So anyway, like, yeah. So kayak it is. It's a little, uh, a little wavy. <laughs> This is that the water activities are actually included when you stay here. So there's kayaking, uh, boogie boards, and kite surfing as well. It's kind of cool. Okay, now that we're a little freshened up, let's go see some other rooms, potentially, hopefully. Let's see what we can do for you guys. So our room is actually very nice, especially for families or small group, but there's a room here that is like outstanding, and hopefully we're gonna be able to show it to you guys. So this is the entrance to the spa and over here there's like a little bit of a boutique section which is really nice. Okay, so downstairs is actually the massage rooms. Couldn't really talk because there's actually someone getting a treatment right now. But when you come upstairs into like the super breezy area is your nail bar. I love that up here and actually if you turn around over here and out here there's a jacuzzi plunge pool as well. Now let's go see the penthouse. Welcome to the penthouse. So when you come in, you have kind of like the same as ours. So you have the dining room table, lounge area, kitchen, and two bedrooms. So one is the master and one is just the second bedroom. But what makes this amazing, besides upstairs, which you're gonna see, is the ceilings are super tall. It's open up there and a really nice staircase that leads up. So you feel like you have so much space. Okay, so now let's go see upstairs. So over here, which is actually outside, but still kind of covered, you have a table area that you can have your meals over here. Through here is another area with lounges. You really don't even need to leave this to go to the main pool. I mean, you can, but you have a nice seating area with a lot of breeze that comes through as well. Then if you keep going, over here, you have the most amazing part. You have your 
private plunge pool here and when you get up you can actually overlook I'm not sure if it's the marina but you see where all the boats are and everything it's beautiful and if you come with kiddos they even have a kid play area it's called Nemo's Cove they got me with the name um, but yeah there's really cool like a jungle gym area I see a story corner an art corner that's really good and they even have a gym I did hear there is a trainer sometimes here as well but it's pretty decent a couple treadmills elliptical weights and then there's an area over here that you could do your stretching or anything that just that does not require equipment oh some exercise balls medicine balls that's fantastic they even have two conference rooms one smaller like a boardroom and there's a bigger one behind me it's currently being in use so we're not gonna disturb anything that's in there <laughs> i think we lucked out it's sushi night yeah i've never seen that in a hotel and like cheap and it's like it's it's part of the package like we have like the full board package yeah. and it's like sushi let's eat sushi like we're getting a platter of 16 pieces like each of us getting a platter um and it's only 15 bucks like 1500 shillings and you're on the canyon coast therefore you know that the fish oh, yeah, is gonna yeah, be yeah. fresh the seafood last night was amazing i'm super excited what a way to end a day yeah. <laughs> tree road take me home relaxing day this was on a beautiful coast in Watamu, Kenya. Now we are gonna, gonna go to bed because tomorrow we have an early morning. And here's a little glimpse. <laughs> Are you are you filming you vlogging me vlogging you vlogging me? Oh yeah, that's not confusing. <laughs> Soaking up the last few minutes of pool time <laughs> that we can and sun. The sun is finally out. It is beautiful. It is warm. Well, Tom was our favorite. And now it's time to leave. But now. Can we move here? Well, yeah, I would love to move here. Yeah, I think you know, coast life would be so much better. So I think much that more would fun. Suit us well. Less traffic, more sun. Like it's great. What's wrong with that? Nothing. Yeah. But now... So Medina Palm, it was for sure for us a great little weekend getaway. We had yeah. a good time, an amazing pool, great little beach access, beach area where you can like eat your meals and everything. Truly enjoyed that. Nice little configuration of accommodation for like, especially if you have a family, you don't want to eat out all the time. Like that was really, really good. It was very good. And a special thank you to Skyward Express for flying us here. <laughs> and otherwise, we will see you in the next one. See ya! <laughs>